Now that the health reform legislation is the law of the land, what effects are you actually expecting for your practice and when are you most likely to start feeling those effects? Hi, it's Jen Gilbert and while everyone is calling this the health care reform, what it really is doing, it's an attempt at reforming the worst practices in the health insurance industry. It's also true that these reforms are going to bring about a lot of changes to the way physicians provide and then bill for the health care services that they render. Now, the following are just some of the changes as explained by an April 21 article, Doctors Five Grapes, about the health law on CNNMoney.com. Let's first talk a little bit about health care. Now, while at the time of this recording, there is a 21% cut in Medicare reimbursements that's still looming under the healthcare industry. The reform law does grant a 10% Medicare bonus to healthcare providers who do bill at least 60% of their charges for primary care. However, this reform law does not offer a permanent fix to the formula that actually causes the cuts in the first place. Now, let's move on to co-payments with Medicare. Beginning in 2011, the health care reform law eliminates co-payments and co-insurance for preventative services and exempts preventative services from the deductibles under the Medicare program. Let's not exclude malpractice insurance. Under this new health care reform law, it does not put a cap on damage award and lawsuits. And finally, certainly one of my biggest pet peeves that always has been, under the new health care law, it still does not stop insurers from meddling into the practice of medicine. Health insurers will still be able to require pre-authorization for treatment. Now, while I understand, yes, this is a cost-saving measure, it's my opinion that it's still not a terrific idea to let insurance clerks with little to no medical training dictate treatments to doctors and their patients. We can only hope that further reforms will curtail this practice to some extent. Now, I invite you to visit with me, learn more at my blog. All of my information is below, and I look forward to seeing you there. Please take care.